every opportunity to make something that's going wrong right. Better call Banka. It is sewage water, and it is seeping onto a neighbor's lawn. It's coming from the Sunshine Mobile Villas in Riverview. The man next door, Tom Fitzpatrick, turned to Better Call Bankin for help last month. And after our report, work finally started to stop the problem. But in a surprising twist, Tom was in court today to stop that work. Eight on your side, investigator Shannon Bankin joins us now. And this is a twist. It is. Now a judge is involved here. And tensions are high as that judge has now ordered work to stop for now. There's the river coming down in. For months, sewage water has seeped up through the ground, making life miserable for Tom Fitzpatrick. It got up deep enough to shut it out my air conditioner. The wastewater is coming from a failed drain field next door at Sunshine Mobile Villas. A Better Call Bank and investigation in late March found that the Florida Department of Health demanded that the drain field be moved away from Tom's irrigation well. The Delaware-based property owner submitted new engineering plans and received the green light from the health department. Work started weeks ago, but tensions here in Riverview have only gotten worse, as Tom claims the work is just leading to more sewage water. It's, it's every day, two or three times a day, draining over here. The mobile home park manager was so fed up by our cameras that she called the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office, claiming harassment. I am not messing with anybody. You are. You are harassing them right now. More raw sewage and more water seeping into my client's heart. Just hours before this, Tom was in court with his lawyer, Michael Owen. They requested an emergency injunction to stop all work until the property owners can prove to the court that work is being done correctly. The injunction was granted. There's been no survey markers that have been put down, so we're not sure that what he's doing is legal, and what he could be doing is making the problem worse. Fitzpatrick is suing for damages. He claims that his health has been hurt by this sewage waste and that has gotten into his home and it's caused mold. He insists that he wants the work done, but he wants to make sure that the court is involved so that he can be sure that it's done correctly. So can you tell if the work that is going on right now is legal, that they're doing it properly? Well, I looked into that today because that's what we were told um, today by the attorney, that he didn't think that it was legal. But when I called the health department, they tell me that they think it is the permit was granted on April 5th and an inspector was on site this past Friday for a routine check. A spokesman tells me that the state thought that the work was progressing and that they weren't aware that this situation was now in court. So hmm. now it's going to get, you know, even more complicated as And it drags out. You start yes. getting the court system mm -hmm. it yeah. really gets long, drawn yes. out. All right. Thank you. Thank Sharon. you. Thanks. If you have a problem that needs solving, better call Bank in. That number is 1-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-888-